Hi guys, how are you doing? Welcome to today's Pick A Card Reading and it is His Current Thoughts, everyone's Friday favourite. So welcome to anyone new, welcome back to anyone returning. My name's Kat, I hope you enjoy the reading today. Um, uh, it's intuitive in general, it's a very short reading so please don't take every single message to heart and think that it must belong to you. Just take whatever resonates, leave what doesn't. If you'd like a private personal reading, which of course will be exactly about your situation, you can check the description box below for a link to book that. You can book it on my website, on Etsy. There are a few different ways if you want. Um, yeah, so I hope you enjoy today's reading. Um, let's go get on with it. So his or her current thoughts. It's kind of obvious what it means. It's what they're thinking at the moment. Okay. Hi, group one. How are you doing? So his or her current thoughts. Four of Wands, Six of Wands, King of Swords, Nine of Coins, Three of Cups, Five of Swords, Seven of Cups. You've got an extra card here than the other groups. So this person is thinking of relationship. This person is thinking of happiness and of prosperity. We've got Four of Wands here is a marriage card. It's also... Um, uh, um, a prosperity card, uh, a, an abundance card. It's a, it's a, it's a stable energy of what, as well with it being a four. It's a, it's a very positive card. So this person is feeling quite stable. Is feeling quite positive. Six of Wands. They feel like they've got there. They've achieved something. Now, for some of you, that might not be what you want to hear. For some of you, it will be what you want to hear. So it depends on your situation. This person feels comfortable, stable, like they're in the place they want to be, definitely, because they've got the six of wands and the nine of coins. This is comfort. This is abundance. And the king of swords, this is a cool male energy. Could be an air sign. Could be someone who's a little a bit emotionally detached. It depends. But this is um, a, a really intelligent sharp thinking male figure um it doesn't have to mean cruel it doesn't have to mean cold or mean um at all not at all um, but it could be the it, it could for one or two of you it could indicate a calculating person who's comfortable in the situation you know they're getting what they want so just watch out for that but that's just a couple of you okay for some of you this person is um, they're presenting as a king, so this is someone who knows what they're doing, who's using their head, who's stable. So if this person has just got a lot of air in their chart, it doesn't mean they're cold, it just means they're an air sign, right? And they're stable and they're they're doing what they're doing because it's right. It's right for them and they know what they're doing. This person isn't vulnerable or a child, this person knows what they're doing, all right? doesn't mean they haven't got issues or vulnerabilities, we've all got them. But you know, this person isn't... Um, in a crisis point or anything, this person knows what they're doing and they're stable. Three of, cu of cups, share the love. This means that they're wanting to offer something and give something. Um, uh, for one or two of you, this can indicate um, that they are sharing their love with other people, which you may know about. You could be in a, in a love triangle with this person. For, this is just one or two of you, but for for the for the majority of you, this is a sign that this, like I said at the outset, this person feels emotional towards you. They want to share with you, um, but with the five of swords, I feel like this person feels like they can't win. They can't get where they need to be. They can't get where they want to be. Um, they don't really know what to do next with the seven of cups. They feel unsure about which way to go. Um, the five of swords is saying that they they feel like they can't win. And that everything they try to do is is not working for them. Um, now, if this person is self-centered and, and self-absorbed, then this is possibly a good sign that you're not letting them get what they want. Um, if this person is not, if you're, if this person isn't this way, then it could be a call for you to be aware of the fact that they feel like they can't win with you. Um, so it might be worth considering why that is. Um, and like I say, not if they're doing something you know, that's uh, hurtful or they're some sort of, you know, um, difficult person or they're not uh, not treating you with respect and value, then this could be a good sign because it's like, well, they can't get there. They can't win. But they are very thoughtful. Daydreams and decisions. They are very thoughtful about how they can get where they want to be. They're trying to decide how to get where they want to be. And, and they're trying to decide the best way to move, the best way to act, the best thing to do. And they're just not really sure. Okay. 
Um, but yeah, so I, I, I don't feel like this is an absolute conclusive thing of which direction they're going to go in. Um, but I think I've said enough there. They're not really saying anything else, so that's fine. So I hope this helps anyway. Loads of love, guys. See you on the next reading or on a private reading. In the meantime, see you soon. Hi, group two. How are you doing? So this is his or her current thoughts. Page of coins, ace of swords, ace of cups, queen of cups, seven of swords, and ace of wands. This person's got a triple ace. This person is looking for a new start, a new beginning. Queen of Cups, they're being very, very intuitive. They could be a little bit emotionally unstable, unbalanced. Um, or if this Queen of Cups is you, they feel a lot of love towards you. They feel a lot of emotion towards you. They could see you as the as your uh they could see you as their romantic partner because we've got love and the Queen of Cups here together. So um there's definitely a feeling of emotion of uh, there's a huge depth of emotion here there's a huge desire to start something new that could bring wealth that could bring opportunity there's also a huge desire to see the truth to cut away the past to move forward there's also with seek the truth this is seven of swords there's some hiding energy someone's not telling the truth this person's not telling you the whole truth that doesn't necessarily mean that they are doing something bad to you. They can be hiding the truth from you to protect you. Or they can be hiding the truth from you because they just feel they can't tell you something or whatever. Um, but it's just... Uh, it's just whatever um, is right in your situation. You know, it's going to be different for each person. But, you know, this person wants new inspiration, new ideas, new possibilities. They're looking to follow their inspiration and their guidance and have a new beginning they want that they don't want to hide the truth they don't want that's the thing this this hiding they could be being almost forced to hide the truth and they don't want to hide the truth they want to move forwards they want to go to a new level they want a new situation you know and and they're i feel like they're being they're being, uh, they're going through a bit of an epiphany. With this triple ace, it's a new cycle. They're thinking of new ways to, to move forwards and they're looking very practically at it. They want love. That is absolutely no, there's no doubt about that. They're looking for love. They want love. They want the new start. So I think that's it. I know it's a little bit short, this group, but that's that's what they're thinking. That's their current thoughts and feelings. Um, so there we go. Their current thoughts. Hope this makes sense. Loads of love. See you on the next reading or on a private reading. In the meantime, see you soon, guys. Hi, group three. How are you doing? So his or her current thoughts. Seven of wands, five of swords, the emperor, seven of swords, heart chakra and four of cups. So this person feels like they're trying to do what's in their heart, but they're blocked around their heart. They're defensive. They could be shut down. They're saying no to an opportunity. They're running away from something. So they can't win somewhere. They feel like they can't get there. They feel like the path that they're on isn't working for them. It's not getting them where they want to be. The Seven of Swords could be for one or two of you that this person's not being honest with you because their heart's shut down and their their guard is up they could be frightened or they could be being dishonest um they're trying to do what's right for them they're trying to fight for what's in their heart with the emperor they they want to take action in their life they're trying to move forward they're trying to take action they're trying to um, do what they can to move forwards in their life. Um, but like I say, they're saying not right now. They're he they're 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 needing to recover from something. They're pained over something. They're also very up in their head. Um, and like, so the seven of wands is saying they are trying to go for what's in their heart, but they've got other people's situations and events in the way. Um, and the trouble is that they're trying to do what's in their heart, but their heart is somewhat shut down here 
Four of Cups is like turning away from an opportunity and saying, I'm not really ready for it. And the Heart Chakra is a shutting down. Seven of Swords is defense is up. So this person wants to take action, but and and does want to go for what's in their heart, but they're shut down, they're closed off, they're not able to get there at the minute. For whatever reason, they're kind of shut down about it. Um but I think the 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 desire is there with the heart chakra and the seven of wands because this is like this person has a desire in their heart but they, for whatever reason they're not taking it right now um they feel very disempowered they like I say their defenses are up and they feel like they can't win so I hope this makes some sense and brings you some clarity Loads of love, guys. I'll see you on the next reading or in a private reading. In the meantime, see you soon.